Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. So in the last video, we learned how to add bank transactions to our QuickBooks online to track our income and expenses. QuickBooks does a great job guessing each transaction by categorizing what the income or expense was. Uh, match is just kind of more of like a manual approach with an existing category you created, but it is really the exact same thing as categorizing and it's just a little bit more... Uh, like I said, again, of a manual approach to keeping track of what you spent or earned. I don't recommend using Match unless you're writing a ton of checks uh, to a ton of different vendors. Uh, the category Match does a more than well enough job for me to keep my income and expenses distinguished. But split is very important and very good to know. What if we, let's go back to the top. Nope, oldest to newest. What if we bought multiple things that fall into two or more categories? Like uh, savings, for example, what if you need to spend, what if you're in charge of your company's advertising budget every single month and your company will not give you next month's budget until you've shown proof that you spent last month's budget? Everything you see on television or YouTube, Burger King, new movies coming out, they have to spend a certain amount of money to get that. They have an advertisement bud budget that is within their business model and it is very, very tax deductible. Okay, so let's find an example. Okay, so let's scroll down here to, let me pull up meals and entertainment. What do we have here? Battle Mage Brewing. Uh, I also work part-time at a brewery and I love it. I live down here in San Diego. Let's look at this, Booze Brothers Brewing Company. This was a keg that we bought and set it up as a beer garden to showcase our business and for people to drink our beer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on meals and entertainment and I'm going to go to split right here. Now I'm going to say that, okay, it's $162.75. Okay, categories go off to meals and entertainment, but I'm also going to put it into advertisement and marketing because we had our logo slapped all over it. Uh, obviously there's loopholes. If you have a construction company and you take that construction company sticker and put it on your surfboard, well now that surfboard purchase is tax deductible. So let's just do, what's this? 81, uh, cut this in half, 81, cut this in half. What's our difference? No, we got to do 75 cents on one of them. So we just split this expense into two different categories, just like that save an ad and it is gone it is now in our quickbooks just like that it is not up for review anymore this went from 151 to 150 let's check it out in quickbooks say we messed up on it here is our booze brothers expense right here let's click on it and it should show us our breakdown here it is all right so we've got our meals and entertainment and advertisement advertising and marketing that is it and like i said again we can if there was a mishap on it, just go over to the right-hand side over here and click undo. That is it. That is how you split. And you can do this vice versa for um, uh, incomes as well. Uh, whether you spent something on this or that, yada, 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 just break it up, put it in your separate categories and organize your thing better. That's what accounting is all about. It's really just organization, how well you stay on top of stuff. That's it. Good luck with this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys rock.